Matt Garska, and I'm here at Guitar Center. I'm here to show you the Byzance line from Meinl and my new signature fat stack. This is my setup, and this is what I use all the time nowadays. And it consists of a variety of uh, different Byzance lines. I'll start with the hats, which are the sand hats, the Benny Greb sand hats. Very nice articulate uh, stick um, attack, but yet it's still uh, got some nice overtones, some nice darker side to it. I've got a, an extra thin hammered crash. This is my main workhorse. And by that, I mean I just smash on that thing all night long. And actually, I feel like these extra thin cymbals, uh, they tend to give in to uh, the beatings a lot better. Then I've got the extra thin jazz crash, which is kind of the secondary crash. Then I have the six inch brilliant splash. That cuts through very nicely, even though it's only six inches, it's really small. Then I got the Vintage Pure Ride. And then have the extra dry China 20 inch. And it's either this or an 18 inch for me. This stack is my baby. I use it in almost every Animals as Leaders song. It's basically a, an 18 inch extra dry cymbal, a crash cymbal with a 16 inch extra dry china. But there's variations, of course, I wouldn't call it my signature stack without making some signature alterations. One being holes in the top and holes in the bottom cymbal. Uh, another being sandblasting on the contact points. And the reason I did that is because I, I really liked the, the crunchy nature of the attack, but I wanted to improve upon the resonance afterwards. Uh, too often I feel like stacks uh, ring out for too long, and not only ring out, but the way that they ring out. It's like this, uh, this high overtone that's it's like metal clinging to metal. And uh, I think this stack beautifully cuts out that aspect. And as a result, it's really trashy, yet it's, it's a, there's a smoothness to it, you know? It's not jarring. If you're in the room and you hear it, it's not like you're covering your ears, you know? Kind of like the whole Byzance line that has this uh, pleasing quality to the ear. All right, and now for the fat stack. I'll start loose and then kind of take it through some of the uh, different articulations. So this is the loosest. Usually I like it about here though. I like it just fat enough, but out of the way as well. 
Byzance line pretty much has everything that you could ask for. I'd strongly urge you to, to check out the, the different lines within there. You can check it out at your local guitar center or guitarcenter.com.